Right, so let's have a go on past pets. So, lock yourself in, off you go. We hadn't really brought in APP um, as such, so we were looking at doing that this year and Class Pet just, just fitted in quite nicely with that. But it's great because you can use it for APP targets or for primary numeracy strategy and different other strategies, so you don't need to know everything about APP to go to plan from Class Pet. I did the setup for the whole school using um, Excel spreadsheets, which took about 20 minutes. So we've had to actually show the teachers how to turn things off until their maths lesson because they were finding the children were logging in at home and completing math assessments before the lesson, which would not happen with anything else. So it's obviously working, the children are enthusiastic, but we just need to watch out when we set the activities, because otherwise they do them before the lesson. The children love that it's on a computer. Uh, you put a computer in front of them, especially the boys, uh, they love that it's on a computer, it's not really learning or assessment, it's not a test, it's on a computer, it's more fun. Uh, they, they like the different ways that the tests work, they like that it reads the questions to them as well, um, and some of them like at the end they also get the sticker and the badge and the, they can also then assess themselves using the traffic light system uh, at the end. It's fantastic to see in both classes you know, the way that they were collaborating and sharing um, and it's great when they get the wrong answer mm -hmm. and go back and you have one of them saying I don't see how I got it wrong, why is that red, why has it come up as red and their friend said well, because you didn't add this number, you forgot to add that tens and you can see the little light bulb moment of when the child says oh, of course I forgot that bit and then they can um, work on it again and get the answer right. We've been using it mainly at the start and at the end of a block of numeracy. So we will set some activities based around addition and then teach a week or two of addition and then assess again at the end to see what the children have learnt. So we're using class to just inform our planning and our assessment. It is far simpler than anything we've used before. It's just drag and drop. Um, you can set activities in seconds. You can play the activities first if you want to. Um, you then just drag them into the tray. That class then get the activity or you can drag it to a particular child and they can see the activity. Yeah, you know your teachers will like it. Yeah, it's really easy and it's hard on them. Yes! And it really helps because if you like find it hard, they can help you fast as well. It helps you learn in other ways. We get to, um, do the activities we get to do it at home. Sometimes at home. Class pet is really cool. When you like, like complete it and you click to see how many like questions you got right, and you feel relieved if you got all of them right, or you feel you need to work a bit harder if you don't get all of them right, and you get like half of them. There's lots of fun activities which like help you learn. I always flick back through the screen to see which one you've done wrong, which ones you've done right, and why. Oh yeah, it's really good. And then and then you can't work them out again because. We've already done it, so and you can just from, learn from your mistakes in there, and it well, works automatically. Well. Really quickly, so it doesn't have to go through. You have to wait for minutes, and, but I just go straight back and have a little more done wrong before I get to see it. And I can do all the activities and then choose the sticker. It's better than just sitting there and writing down. Uh, looking at the results that come back, it's, it's quite good to see that the children might do really well in level three but struggle in level four. So that is matching up with what we think in this particular class. So that 
for us is good that we, we know that it's, it's you know, merging with what we're doing already. Um, at the moment we've got about three or four teachers across Key Stage 2 that are using it. Uh, the plan is to continue that rollout, uh, so within the next few weeks we'll have the whole of, um, the whole of Key Stage 2 on board and then Key Stage 1 hopefully later on in the summer term. Very simple to use, um, definitely worth having a look at.